We are not back. We're the opposite of back. I just spent the past hour, like, dicking around on homework. On one assignment that was beating my ass. And then, uh, simultaneously coming up with a playlist that, uh, will get me semi-monetized. So, you know what? The main money maker here is Twitch. If I don't make my 0.05 cents on YouTube, so be it. I'm just gonna have to make that, uh, that sacrifice. That is unfortunate, very scary, and quite frankly, I don't know what to say. I did finish it actually, don't worry. I don't- I'm responsible. It's just Okim and biological writing final. Cause I already finished my 11 page long research paper, which doesn't sound like a lot, but it like is to me. Cause I was like, it's a semester long project, yeah? So then I was like, holy fuck, I did all that? For nightmares, honestly, it depends on your professor. I'm having a pretty decent time. Break from finals in bio, but like literally, Thanks team, you guys picking up the slack. I mean, picking up my slack, I should say. I've been good. Admittedly a little, uh, I guess not that stressed. How much longer do you have to finish your degree? Well, I am a junior, but since biology major is such a big thing, and I'm, I'm like, I just started minoring in Pan-African studies, it's like adding on to it, so like, probably like, one year is normal, plus probably another one, or maybe a half one, I don't even know anymore. Whatever happens, happens. Took you five years? That's reassuring. I thought I would be like the only one doing four, like more than four years, but that's reassuring. Sour Breaks? Dude, if he had a K in his name, that'd be like such a K Project reference. Sorry. Dude, I need one viewer to have watched K Project and actually finished it, kitty. Like, nerd out about it. I think the only Splatoon streamer who's seen it, besides me making Sour watch it, is Kurta. Cause I was like, dude, is that the ending theme to it? And I was like, holy shit! You'll do it. Be warned with the fan service, but you know what? It is nothing compared to nowadays. I can handle it though. I have a pretty low tolerance for that stuff. Like, okay, here's how it is. Like, everyone in that show is like, a gay guy, okay? There's like, one straight couple, everyone else is gay, and then like, there's like, two female characters well three but one like you know of age and they projected all onto those two characters and it's like the funniest thing ever it's like oh man we gotta make sure the the straight male demographic keeps on watching <laughs> that sounds pretty gay not gonna lie it is pretty gay you should see the official art dude they got like the red strings of fate and they're all like in their face oh my lord also, this is K Project OST, by the way. I fucking love it. Okay, they aren't gay bait though. Like none of them get in a, get in a relationship. Like, <laughs> like it's never confirmed, but it's never deconfirmed. It's like pretty out there, dude. Like, there's a certain quote where he says, like, "I thought breathing the same air as me made you nauseous," and the other guy says, "Sometimes I like breathing toxic air," and it's like, oh my god, get a room. I have an AP brain rot test tomorrow. Wish me luck. Good luck. I hate AP stuff. I can't believe they make you pay money to take the exam. Do you think high school is already gonna drain all your money? Wait till college, you need to pay to get your degree. That's so funny to me. Like, actually, like, physically get it. Like, you've already finished your years. You have to pay for the piece of paper or something. It's so stupid. To pay to exist. I mean, that's like life, but you know what I mean. Or capitalism, we should say, not life. We get, we, we're getting economical in, in Anike's server today. To play the fireman song? Which fireman song? You have to be a little more, uh. Okay, how about this? You guys can give me your fireman songs and your Kirby music in my Discord, and I will make a video game OST playlist because I just wanted to prove to chat that I do not just listen to that stuff. I have more than that. When I used to stream just on Twitch, I was a little more free with what my music choice was, but now I am a little limited, so. Yeah. I mean, you can give me a name and I can check because apparently being a YouTube creator, you can just check like your uh if a song is like eligible for monetization i think that's pretty cool because like you can check like basically any language of song he thinks would you be willing to play some cookie run music uh yeah sure i have the cherry blossom theme as my brb song which i admittedly don't use a lot because i just sit here and <laughs> for two and a half hours straight but you know that's how it is if you guys can't tell i had a little bit of coffee earlier <laughs>
That's probably why I'm okay with streaming alone, because I myself can carry the conversation of just talking to myself. What's this from? This is from K-Project. Or, it's just called K, but like, I don't want to call it K, because that's just confusing and weird. But it is officially called K, but at, at one point it was a project, even though it's literally already finished. I think it's been finished for like five years or something. <laughs> what are you watching? K yeah, exactly. It's like... Google searches for that stuff sucks too. And there's no merch anymore because it's kind of like an old show, but like... Okay, the thing with it is that it has a lot of like really popular uh, voice actors, both English and JP. Like you got like Matt Mercer, which is like my definition of big voice actor. You got uh, like uh, Ghetto and Gojo. I recommend... well, they're both like good voice actors, but I think I prefer the, the dub. Sorry, the sub, the sub, the sub. I just really like the way Saruhiko, which is one of my favorite characters, does his lines. He's really unhinged with it. But the English one isn't that bad from what I've heard. I've never watched it in entirety, but it's like, you know, they're good voice actors. They do have the whole Juju cast on there. Is Evangelion acceptable to watch dubbed? If you ask Sau- That is- Alright, what the fuck? Never mind. Um, Evangelion is- I mean, I think it's the Netflix dub, yeah, that Sour watches, but I don't really like Evangelion, to be quite honest with you. I do like the rebuilds, though, because in my opinion, it gets rid of a lot of the bullshit that I don't like watching. Like, you know, weird shit. I didn't- I kind of skimmed through the original, because I'm gonna be real with you, a lot of the things I've seen nowadays I've been forced to watch against my will, and I- you know, I don't know, man. When I'm forced to watch things against my will, I tend to not like them. It has that kind of, like, tainted thing on me. <laughs> ah, shoot. Who's the kind of mainstream artist you listen to? Like, someone we'd all know. That's a problem. I don't really listen to mainstream artists. And if I did, it's literally just one song from them. The only popular song I can think of is the one that's called Golden Hour. I don't know how to pronounce their name. It's like the JVKE guy or whatever. That's like probably the most popular song I think I listen to. Admittedly, most of the music that I listen to is like... Considered indie, I guess. I don't, I don't really know. I, don't, I, I honestly just don't listen to a lot of music. I do my things in like... <laughs> Weirdly incomplete silence or music like it's one or the other how I feel that day. I do not listen to Taylor Swift What part of <laughs> how many times do I have to joke about her to make it clear that I don't, I don't freak with her? Was the Kenjaku Swift one mixed messages to you guys pronounced Jake? That is so corny That's like every like video gamer his name ever like oh, I'm gonna replace my name with an X <laughs> Yeah, I don't when I listen to music, I don't like. I'm just, I'm just there for the song, dude. Like, I don't do my research, is what I'm saying. Cause then again, I don't listen to that much music, anyways. Oh yeah, I started playing poker, Poke Rogue. Is that how I say it? Yeah, Poke Rogue. It's interesting. I gotta say though, I am not a big fan of the rival. They're like, come home, like. And I'm like, oh my god, stop bitching and just let me, <laughs> let me have my life-changing journey as a 12-year-old. Ivy, is there another one? Yes, if you change, if you, if you become trans, you actually do get a different rival. I think I like the the male one better. I don't remember what his name was. I think it was something dumb. Well, I, I could be wrong. Hang on, I have a picture of it. I sent it to Soup. His name is Finn. Yeah, that's pretty dumb. Sorry to all Finn name havers in chat. <laughs> Very sorry. I hope no one is actually named that. Finn Adventure Time is quaking. <laughs> I'm so sorry for the adventure time. Go back to drinking your Fanta. I hate bugs at the interaction. Even me? And then I'm gonna be like, no, it's okay. I don't actually hate you. I wouldn't hate you. It's like the- also, thank you for the follow Nova Kid. You know those like tweets that are like, I hate when people do this in their art style. And then the, their, their mutual response being like, is my art style okay? It's like the exact same thing they describe. And they're like, no oomph, it's, it's perfect. Like... <laughs> It's so fucked up. <laughs> Admittedly though, if a guy named Finn does come in chat, I will start feeling bad. I'll feel bad, but I'll apologize on your behalf for being named that. I feel- you know what? Here's something that I won't back down from. This isn't like a subtweet of a Splatoon player. I'm saying this because I know somebody in real life whose name is this, or like they change it to this. If your name is Basil in real life, because of the Amori character, I'm gonna laugh at you. This is not related to the Splatoon player. What if I transgender into a fin? Then I would congratulate you, but <laughs> it's like that one post on Reddit that's like, Hey, my friend's changing their name to Meredith. How do I tell them not to do this? 
Like, I'm all for their transition, but like, fucking Meredith? Mildred! Mildred! I knew it was like a really old white lady M name. <laughs> Jonathan Jonathan? That can't be a real name. The new Garfield movie releases next Friday? I did not know that. I didn't even know there was a new Garfield movie, what? The only thing on Gar of Garfield I've seen on my on my timeline was the 1984 comic for Mother's Day. Or maybe it's not from 94. Maybe like they just spread information. Did you guys see that one tweet that was like, um, did you guys know that we're not getting hydrated by the water that we drink when it's distilled? <laughs> and I was like, dude, these are the same people that believe like that you can you you require detoxes as if your liver doesn't already do that for you. You know, unless something's wrong with your liver. Then do you prefer Oven Break or Kingdom? Oven Break all the way. I do not like Kingdom that much. I think the graphics are pretty, but I think the gameplay is boring as hell. It's cooldown simulator. That's probably just my bias though, because I don't like cooldown simulators that much. I say, as I probably play a game that does that. Oh yeah, Chris Pratt is Garfield. Oh god. Is he good in that? I don't even remember. Thank you for the fo Holy shit, Undertale. Thanks for the follow. Undertale itself? Oven break is better, cookies are cooler too. I'd have to agree with that statement. Also, it's like, it's less, like, they still want your money, obviously. It's a gotcha game. But it, I think it's also less gotcha game because of the new, like, Korean gambling laws. But I haven't really played Cookie Run, bef like, after that, so I wouldn't really know. But also with the skins, like, the skins are attainable. Like, I have the skins that I want. Admittedly, I have played for Rainbow Cubes before, but Kingdom, I feel, is a different demon with their skins. The fact costumes have an actual benefit instead of it being cosmetics. That's true, huh? It does give uh, benefits in Oven Break. Unless there's something I don't know about in Kingdom. I saw the most tragic art piece earlier and I just had to sit down and think about my life for a second. That reminds me, someone commented on my YouTube video and they were like, I did not expect to see Fire from Heroes on a Splatoon video. And I was like, <laughs> I didn't know how to like respond to it, but I wanted to say something along the lines of like, there's more where that came from. I should have just said that. Why did I just come up with it? I just came up with the like the response to an argument in the shower like 24 hours after it happened. It's too late now. I can't I can't show my face again. I'm uh doing the normal. I got music on. Getting partially monetized, but you know what? That's okay. Cause YouTube can take my 0.05 cents at the expense of me not having to listen to Splatoon OST for two and a half hours straight. You see, you know an art piece is good if I start coughing at it. Nothing has made me cough yet, though. You know, let me go to my other account. Uh, not- it's not like a weird account, it's just- I've- I've tailored my timeline- Holy mother of god, sorry, ahem. I've tailored my timeline on my private account to just be all the characters I like. And let me tell you, it does wonders. This shit is like meticulously crafted. My other, like, acronym I'm really confused about is like- What was it again? It was ATP. Like, nurtured aside, like, I do not think of at this point as the first thing. Like, I have to think about it. I have to sit there and think about it. Same with if you know, you know. Because, like, I know what it means. I just, like, I have to think when I type it out. Because I'm like, if you know. Like, ik, ik, you know what I mean? <laughs> I also love pronouncing acronyms. Like, ishbol. <laughs> Saying ishbol is like, you guys already knew that. But that's like, ha! The funniest thing to me. <laughs> LMAO. I say lmao, though. I do not know what foe means, let me guess. Fear of hearts. Fuck olives. I don't know what the H is. Fuck out of here! <laughs> I've heard GTFO. I also like Lumafow. Yeah, I, I don't know any of those games of real with you. Like, obviously I've heard of Fallout and Celeste, but I don't play those. Because I'm uh, really bad at platformers. I know that's just Celeste, but yeah. Do not put me in a platformer game. Greedy, I can kind of deal with, but like... Do not put me in a 2D platformer game. I will cry. Last time I played Ultimate Chicken Horse, I almost cried. It's just awful. Is Cookie Run a platformer? Oven Break is, yes, a 2D platformer, but like... Y you move on a linear line, you just have to time your jumps. It's like, it's like playing a rhythm game, really. If you think about it. That's probably not right at all, but I think it's funny. Where's Fortnite? I'm not gonna lie, I kind of fell out of that pretty fast, but it's because I'm really bad at playing on my keyboard. Like, I'm, I'm good at what I do, but I mean, like, I keep fucking up my my arms and my wrists. I don't know why. Like, I try to have good posture, like, you know? 
I looked up like the ergonomic posture for it, but it just still happens. I don't know why. It doesn't happen when I play on my controller or whatever, so I don't know. It's weirdly only with like not with Splatoon though. Like with Splatoon, I definitely move my wrists a lot more because you know motion controls. I get like I don't know. It's, I just don't know what it is. It's probably the position of my arms because this is more on my lap. I would not know. Sorry, that's all you get from me. <laughs> I get nervous. I had coffee to prevent myself from taking a nap, and I didn't take a nap. That was pretty cool. Were you a bad kid, like, sour in school? Hell no. I attended all my classes. I didn't sleep in class like a bum. Me and sour would be the exact opposite. Because the most I do is probably text in class when you're not supposed to. Because, like, fuck high school. And I'd probably text sour during that. I'd be like, dude, what are you doing? One time, um, my friend got this peach from the cafeteria. And... He was eating it, and inside there was a worm. Thankfully, he didn't eat the worm yet. Uh, so we were all screaming about it, just watching it wriggle across the cardboard like lunch plate thing. And so then the, the, what do you call them? Like school monitor guys? Like comes over and he's like, "What are you guys screaming about?" And we're like, "There's a worm in our food!" And then he was like, uh, "Ew, uh, ew, ew!" And he just walks away like hands up. <laughs> He did not want to take responsibility for the school having wormy food. <laughs> you should have ate the worm yourself so you had grounds to sue and make money. Yeah, I pray that it was a parasitic worm. Actually, don't pray for that. I thought y'all went to the same high school. We were admittedly pretty close, but we never met each other during that time because his parents weren't cool with online friends. I love the chicken and fries that the and Sloppy Joe's. Oh, dude. Am I allowed to blame Michelle Obama for the shitty food at my school? Because, like... In elementary school, we got a whole chicken. Unseasoned, probably boiled, no salt, no pepper, no nothing. It was disgusting. She got rid of energy drinks and soda, sold them in middle school. Energy drinks not good for kids, but still. Yeah, she put LaCroix in my school. <laughs> I'm sorry all LaCroix fans, but I really don't like... I, don't, I really don't like uh, water with fruit sneeze in it. She took away your strawberry milk. That's not even unhealthy! We had chocolate milk at our school! How is strawberry milk any worse? If it's artificial, I get it, but like... That's your fault. As in the school's fault. Strawberry milk has more sugar in it, but isn't it like, Oh, it's like natural sugar, some bullshit, I don't know, man. It's fruit sugar. What are you talking about, duck? You had to be very lucky or very quick to get strawberry milk back then, they were scarce as fuck. Yeah, I can imagine. The true moo chocolate milk. I think I had like those unidentified ones that were like, really monochrome. You had persimmons at your school? I would kill for persimmon. Can we talk about Nesquik strawberry milk? No. Okay! <laughs> Yay! Uh, it's pretty decent, I think. Honestly, I don't like most strawberry milk, because I just don't like milk, period. But like, the one with the actual strawberries in it, I will like. I just, I don't know. I just don't trust milk in the... I don't know. I don't like carton milk. I feel like I'm ingesting micro papers. Micro cardboards. They had their own breakfast bin. You could just go across the school and steal breakfast from other classes. Ugh, oh, that's me at college now, dude. Not that they have that, but like... Guys, my number one tip to anyone in college right now and paying for their tuition or loans, whatever, just take the free shit. Don't have morals. If they have free shit, just take it. You're paying how much money for existing? Fuck them. Take that free pen from the college fair. I used to have morals about it, but I learned very quickly that I shouldn't. Be unapologetic. There is no free stuff at college. That's true, nothing in life is free or something. But you know what, it'll make me feel better about myself, about my, like, my 50 cent pen. For like my $90,000 tuition, that's just a number I made up by the way. I deserve the free checks mix. Dude, I went to this like, board meeting and they had free like, random ass sun chips. I really should have just filled my whole bag in front of them really loudly and obnoxiously when our president was doing like, fuck all, fuck nothing, I don't know. Ah! I got bag shouted by the Virgin Mary! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's actually so fucked up. This was not in the Bible. <laughs> the title is crazy too. I'm canon in the Bible now. Careful, Zerk. Last time I said that, I almost got crucified. Uh, pun not intended. 
I have a strange memory of some white arachnid crawling out of a small juice carton I was gonna drink out of. Never did find out what the fuck that was about. You're just sharing. Punk hamster. It just reminded me that Overwatch literally added a hamster character. And then that further reminded me that th there's... <laughs> I'm not even gonna say it. I'm just gonna get disappointed again. Something something, Thai character in Overwatch, something something, you know what, as long as the voice actor is getting paid like crazy. You know, when I was younger, I really wanted to play Overwatch 1, you know, because I was a kid, I didn't really know any of the controversy. I don't even know if it was a thing by then. Like, surely it was, but just behind the scenes, you know what I mean? Uh, I, like, I, I really wanted to play Widowmaker. I, I would watch Widowmaker players, like that one guy that always gets trick shots. That's what I, that's like, that's what I wanted to be when I, when I played Splatoon. And then I tried two. And I was like, man, this game fucking sucks. <laughs> like, <laughs> ignoring the obvious problems. This game fucking sucks. Company sucks. The people sucks. RC! <laughs> Guys. Stop. I play with Pro Controller. I used to play with Joy-Cons, because, you know, Pro Controllers are a little expensive. But, yeah. If they didn't drift, I'm sure they'd be fine. But, unfortunately, they kind of do. I don't have ads on YouTube. Oh. So is that like a don't watch my YouTube because I don't have ads or make the viewers watch it for ad money? Or sorry, not ad money, uh, watch hours. That's a terrible grind, by the way. I hate watch hour grind so much. I'm so glad I don't have to do it anymore. Watch hour grind son or YouTube shorts view daughter. Oh my God, watch hour grind son. Like, I don't know. Like, don't you need like a mil- a million like over a million for for youtube shorts that just sounds like terrifying i think i know it takes less effort and you like shit them out but like still three million is so crazy dude like how give it to anna like, make my editor paycheck big and round <laughs> Ugh, i don't even want to vod review my own stuff and by vod review i mean watching my own vods and finding all the funny parts and I'm really bad at remembering to stream marker myself. Like, that would literally make my life so easy, but I just forget. And also, I need to find a way to do it on YouTube, because at least YouTube archives my VODs. I don't like VOD reviewing my streams. It's probably better when you don't, uh, when it's not your own content, I think. I think my thing is also just like, I hate opening up the editing program, dude. See, the thing, the, the thing, I, I, what am I trying to say? The thing, comma, Mars is that the more, it's like exposure therapy, like, I, d I used to hate my voice so much, but like, now I'm like, yeah, that's my voice, that's me. Yeah, you get used to it after, but it's really weird. Cause like, I used to be like, I don't get how people can ever get used to their voice, but here I am now. I think it was even before content creation though, cause I, I had like an, <laughs> I had like an ego bump, guys. So, around like my first or second year of college, which was I guess not that long ago, there was this guy in my class who was like low-key transphobic and he was like in the canvas discussion board that uh, trans people like rewrite the laws of the universe and like I took that like I was God. Like I, I was like, I was like Gojo for a second. Like the, <laughs> I was like, holy shit, like I'm God. Like I rewrite the laws of the universe. That's fucking awesome, dude. And then like, I just, <laughs> look, I'm not saying I have a God complex, but like, listen. It got so bad, well it didn't get that bad where like any slurs were thrown out, but like the, the professor did email being like, I'm so sorry, I'm like, yeah, it's okay. I think I'm still riding that high, honestly. Like, you don't get what it did to my mental state. Like, I used to be like a pretty like humble guy, and like, I know I still kind of am, but like, oh my god, sometimes I feel like I'm just the coolest fucking person in the world. It's like that, uh, that, uh, that transgender hydra thing, and I'm like, thinking to myself, like, that'd be a sick ass tattoo. It's not a god complex, it's quite simply you'd win. That's true. I know you went to SoCali, but how many of the tender defenders went to LTC or planned to go to Riptide? I don't think any of us went to LTC, right? I mean, I, I hope I'm not forgetting someone. Oh yeah, GX, there's GX. That was, that was RC and Chase. For Riptide though, I don't know. I went to Switch Fest in 2019, does that count? I don't plan on Riptide unless someone is basically sugar daddying me and paying for everything. Yeah, that's my that's my logic with any land that isn't like in my face. What in the country fried fuck is a switch fest? It was like I don't know if it was a recurring thing, probably. Cause I know that's the only one I went to, and that was the last one that was there. But yeah, it, there was Splatoon, there was Pokémon. I think there was Melee, cause like you know, 
That's all I remember. I met Tech. I met Q, Jared. Uh, I think I met Soko and Corduroy. It was pretty fun, but thank god I don't have to take this game seriously for a while. I mean, not that I take it seriously before SoCali, but like during, it's like, I guess I have to try. Or I try to try, and then I, you know what I mean. When I have my degree, I'm gonna go to so many cons. Okay, now cons is- oh fuck, thanks for reminding me to get my AX ticket. So I wanna remind me to do that after stream. I'm not gonna remember. Ah, oh, but I should wait for my paycheck, dude. That's like a hundred dollars. Fuck. I've been spending a lot of money recently, guys. All them business expenses. True. Don't worry, guys. My paycheck is literally tomorrow. I'll be fine. I mean, unless you want me. You got for it. So yeah, I'll definitely do it tomorrow. I just gotta remember. Ah, oh, but tomorrow's Wednesday. I don't have school tomorrow, but I do have a final on Thursday, so I gotta spend all of tomorrow, or at least as much as I can of tomorrow, studying for my OCHEM final. Ugh gross. It's not hard or anything, but I haven't really been, like, preparing for the most recent, like, subjects, like the DL's Alder reaction or whatever the fuck you want to call it. Like, I haven't really memorized that. I might even make Annika default tenor to finish my tune to. Gone tired of the Sour Breaks course. It's a lovely change of beats. <laughs> I'm glad. Not glad that you're leaving Sour. But <laughs> I can't wink because I turned it off, but eh. <laughs> I get a headache when I drink coffee. Yeah, no, my hands are sweating. My, or, yeah, no, it's pretty gross. Uh, I can't stop talking, which is a good thing for stream. Which is why, like, I was thinking to myself like before stream, like, if I don't stream, I will literally die. So that's why I'm able to hold a conversation with myself. I don't normally like streaming alone for that reason, that I can't hold a conversation, and I feel it's like I don't know, hard. But I don't want to willingly drink caffeine, considering how badly it affects me. But Today was exam day. Or, not exam day, like, I just didn't want to take a nap today. I was already tired at the beginning of the day, so I was like, we just gotta, we gotta nip it in the bud. I don't, I don't know, man, I don't really trust YouTube shorts. It's like trusting TikTok with your life advice. I'm joking. I'm not joking about that part, but I'm... The lollipops are the one I tried, I mean the video game, but I actually... My friend wants to give me mealworms to try, like, dried mealworms, and let me tell you, maybe it was just because, like, it was a bad brand, but it tasted like chlorine, I didn't really like that. I've never had like a scorpion lollipop or something like that though. Like what do you do with the scorpion? Is it just there for show? Is it fossilized? Do you eat it? What does it taste like? Ah. I'd rather eat flatworms than eat mealworms. I think I'd rather eat mealworms. Flatworms are disgusting. Mealworms are like, they're like <laughs> shriveled Cheetos if you really think about it. Or if you don't think about it, I should say. So I know a lot of cultures eat bugs, but like, so like, <laughs> maybe the chlorine was just like, they're just a, a gag gift, that's why. They weren't, you know. Because, like, I know, like, eating bugs is like, oh, that's so gross. But, like, you know, shrimps is bugs or whatever. I don't think I'd like it because I don't like meat, period. But, like, you know what I mean? Because, like, Thai people eat bugs, too. So, yeah, no. But then again, I don't like all Thai food. Like, I don't, I don't like, uh, blood soup or whatever. Like, the gelatinous stuff. I don't like that. Shrimps count as bugs. Aren't lobster technically bugs? Yeah. Crustacean station or whatever. I don't know. Splatoon reference. Also, the thing with my music, whoever said they wanted to watch me because of it. This is new. Like, literally new. Because I get partially monetized for this on YouTube. And I get I don't make that much YouTube like money anyways. Especially for streams. Uh, but yeah. It's just a matter of how greedy I am for my 0.05 cents of the day. Don't you just record the footage with the music excluded or does it not work? I tried that and I fucked it up because I was too stupid to understand how audio channels work. Because it ended up like getting rid of like- it, it, it kept my voice but not the game audio and I was like, I'm too stupid to figure this out. What do you mean by bot problem though? I don't see a bot in... YouTube chat, I don't see a bot in... Discord... Must mean something else. Oh! Right, sorry. <laughs> I do that a lot, I'm like, oh. Uh... For real, dude, I can't believe the bot problem just instantly got worse. He's like, I'm fixing it, I'm fixing it. I could do it. I know nothing about computer science, that's a lie. I did at one point, and then I decided I hated it. I wanted to be different from all the other Splatoon players and not be a comp sci major. You play Splat, you have a comp sci degree, don't lie. Guys, I might be lying, I have a PhD in computer science. Like, I took AP comp sci, 
That was, uh... Especially during COVID, too. That was pretty ass. The ouchie is crazy. They can get in Nintendo and start fixing issues. See, the funny thing is, that could be real. Like... Like, <laughs> just apply on Twitter. At X hiring. Get jobs through... Twitter, or whatever. <laughs> I was like, wait. I'm doing a double major with comp sign music, so I'm <laughs> typical. Can you fix the Twitter Nintendo API issue with your comp sign PhD? I sure can try. I might make it worse, though. I might somehow fuck up Facebook, too. I don't know why you would post Splatoon clips on Facebook, but, you know, that's our only option at this point, even though we have, you know, the ignore that QR codes exist for, like, three seconds. For the bit. That reminds me that prof my professor actually leaked his password for something, and then uh, one of the students was, like, warned him, of course, but then they were like, I won't hack your account, and he was like, no, you're hacking my account. <laughs> He's like, damn, I have to change it now. I don't even know what the password is for. I think it was his Google account, actually. I've been, like, unintentionally growing out my hair. Cause, yeah, you know me, I always like having short hair. I say it, like, cause all my sonas have it, but... But, uh... Now there's hair in everything, dude. I found hair in, like, my food, and I find hair in, like... I was doing lab, and, like, my hair is everywhere, I'm like, dude... Root beer float? Uh, I have pretty mixed feelings about root beer. Normally I don't like root beer, but sometimes, like, if it's, like, blueberry-flavored root beer, I like it. Mostly cause the blueberry is carrying, but you know how it is. I say that like you do. But I'm gonna assume that you do. It's my head canon that you you do in fact like you are in fact picking up what I'm putting down. There's different root beer flavors, yeah. It's probably like, you know, looked down upon in the try hard root beer community, but cream soda is so interesting to me. It is. I don't like I like I don't know. I've never really had it, so I wouldn't really know. But I feel like the way the texture is intertwined is like I don't know. It feels like putting milk in water essentially. Why is iron lung trending? What did Microplier do this time? Is it done? There's a trailer! Oh shit, I don't- if I, I feel like if I watch it right now- Okay, I'll just watch it right now on mute, and I'll describe it. We are inside of a rusted metal whatever this is. The camera slowly pans, like, nauseatingly to the right. I don't like that. Stop that. Ugh. What's the menu? Uh, let me get it first. I can't watch this, this is making me nauseous. It's just slowly rotating, don't do that. <laughs> it's like a, it's like in Doki Doki Literature Club when like the pan, like the camera just pans slowly to the right and you're like, oh, stop. Stop. It wasn't going to shit shit, but it, it was at three bars and I didn't like the look of that. Oh, fuck. Um, 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 um. Chill. I had mac and cheese in the fr freezer. Fr 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 freezer. Um. With broccoli in it, though. That's pretty good. I'm very sick of it, though. That's all I ever eat as a kid. I would have thrown my controller uh, into the void if that had hit me. Don't worry, I'm not a controller thrower. I'm not. I would never actually do that. <laughs> it's a metaphorical throw into the imaginary void. I throw it in my head. I imagine it. <laughs> Don't worry. I've literally never in my life have thrown a controller. It's so. I am not wasting $70. That's how to make your <laughs> controller drift like crazy, dude. I already feel bad enough when I accidentally drop one and I'm like, oh, I can feel the drift already. I fucked it up. Starting you. You know, an anime I really wanted to watch was Tales of Symphonia anime, but I promised to watch that with Sour, even though I'm the Tales of Symphonia fan. If my favorite character dies, though, I'm gonna end it all. Because I heard that the. It takes a different story route that is. Nothing like the games, or different from the games, I should say. Which is cool, don't get me wrong, but I will- the barnacles. What other animes have you seen? Not that many, I don't watch a lot of anime. I think I've seen some of Hell's Paradise. Uh, I like Cho Bay, I think his name was, I don't even fucking remember. The blonde guy with the scars, I like him a lot. It's pretty surface level like, but you know what I mean. Uh, what else? Uh, I've seen the, the one that's called like Laughing Under the Clouds or whatever, like two episodes, and I think the, the Tanka guy is pretty hot. But I never finished it. I don't really like watching anime by myself, but like I don't want a crowd either. I don't know, man. Mario Party? Dude, last time that happened, the whole thing just like went awry. Like, like my, my internet died, we literally like stopped playing like in the middle of it. I mean, shit, okay. Sure. If you can find three other people, Juan, I will play Mario Party. Ah, uh, we have a problem. Is this a physical game that I have or something else? Ooh, I could finally beat Farmum Engage, guys. 
wait guys i mean i beat it but the dlc that i paid for and never played okay are we feeling mario party superstars or uh fireman gauge and then y'all end up going back to the saloon exactly okay how about this uh okay but like my my pristine home screen will know what am i saying mario mario kart's right there <laughs> it's already fucked up but sure it probably has my real name in there but you know what it's not like hidden knowledge some of you guys like misspell my name like anike into my real name and i just look at you weird because i'm like how do you do that i know they're similar but why, why would you do that you scare me my name is not anime though that would be funny I do have a biased answer, like I, I know what I want to do, but I will listen to the people for once in my life. It's not like a mess up spelling like that, but rather like you hit a letter on like kind of close, like it's not even that close. I mean it is close, but like not close enough to make it a common typo. It's like you have to try. Ding 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 anteaters, you even spelled it right, how'd you spell it right? Normally people spell it with one N. <laughs> how'd you spell it right? Even the people who type my name wrong still spell it with, with one N. The pronunciation is a little confusing though, because my parents pronounce it differently than I do. Then my preferred pronunciation is pretty interesting.